Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say thank you for the support. I really do appreciate it. I'm trying to get 100,000 subscribers, so if you want to help me out, make sure to subscribe. Now enjoy the video. The air is still even filthier as I imagined it. Still putrid to even breathe it in. But, nonetheless, I'm still here. Now, well, finally, you woke up. You miss me, insect. Yes, I know. My mechanical arms aren't really something to be... showing. But ever since... All for One's escape, and all the rest of the escapees, we gained a little bit of money to get these... temporarily put onto my body. I can use them in such as my quirk intended. But skin graft is a lot more expensive than we thought. So, as of right now, I'm stuck with these metal arms. But I can still use them to my ability. What, do you think most of the criminals were just going to stay in prison? Of course not. Of course I escaped, but with the help of someone. She helped me escape, and she took me under her wing for just a little bit. I was completely out of it. I was only focusing on finding my father. But, after she got, well, let's just say dealt with, I kind of ran, and... Head to myself. Afterwards, all for one, and Shigaraki found me. I was just quivering in some sort of alleyway by myself, still questioning why I was escaped and how I'm going to find my father. They took me in, and they gave me these prosthetics, because they had just enough money left over. Well, the deal with you is I need skin. I need a skin transplant. But there's not enough skin on my body to transplant it from me to my arms. So we're looking for other donors. Of course, pig skin is quite easy to come about, but with all the criminal rates at this point, there's not much out there to sustainably transfer it. Of course, the criminals are out of their minds as of right now. They don't know what's right from wrong, what's left from right, what's up from down. All they care about is causing pain to others and stealing what they want. Uh, well, you could say that, that we're all the same, but... I could also say the same about you heroes. All you are the same unless you want something. All, every single one of you. You want something in return for your heroism. Either be a paycheck, fame, or even just a simple glance. You crave attention. As from us villains, well, we do as well, but other... Don't interrupt me, insect, or I'll dissect you like the one you are. As I was saying, of course us villains crave attention more than the heroes do, but we do it for our own terms. 
We want the attention to show that heroes are nothing but a bunch of liars. Lying because, well, whatever they get paid, they're promised to protect. Your promises are nothing but a staple. And it can easily get removed by the unstaplers. Our staple removers. A.K.A. Us. Every single one of you heroes are nothing but sniveling, money-hungry, fame-grubbing insects. You don't care about these people. Hell, if you really did care about these people, you would give them homes. Do you know how many lives I've seen on the streets struggling even for their next meal? Struggling from the cold winters, the outrageous hot summers, dying of heat stroke, hypothermia, and even thirst. It's disgusting. Seeing their filthy bodies on the street like that makes me gag. If you were true heroes, you would help the ones who are in need. Not the ones who beg for help because they see their lives flashing before their eyes all because of something simple they can run away from. You're not a hero. You're a civilian with powers. Powers that you just need to train by those who call themselves heroes. If you were truly a hero, you would help the ones who are actually in need. <laughs> Your face says it all. Knowing the truth because you weren't taught right. Knowing the truth because, well, you were taught by the heroes to do what's right for this world. Hmm? Putrid insects deserve nothing but the worst. You understand that. All bugs like yourself need to be squished under a boot. You just need the right teachings to be not squished like a bug. It's easy. All I need from you is a simple drop of blood. And then I can bring you back to the scientists who can make skin. Or he can make you into a nomu. Yes, those disgusting creatures that Shigaraki controls. But I don't need a nomu made out of you. Hell, I barely even want to see your face, but your skin is closest to mine, so I need you alive. So all I need from you is just a simple blood drop. And then you can tell all your heroes who took you away from them. You can teach them the things I told you today. And they will all be quiet because they know that they have been tricking you this whole time. <laughs> That's not very hero-like of you to be talking to me like that. But... Who is to say you're a hero anyway? Who is to say that you are a hero? Or you could just be in disguise. You, like I said, you're nothing but a civilian with powers taught to use them by the wrong people. Now, 
Let's get that drop of blood, shall we? Just one simple prick. There we go. That's a good hero. I'm done with you now. You can escape. Just remember, tell your hero buddies, your friends, that the only thing that you have been teaching is lies. See you later, hero. I'll be seeing you soon.